Welcome back, everybody. I cannot wait to take you through this property. This is a Dries Lynn Martu in Treviso, one of the most stunning neighborhoods in Leander, just north of Austin. This is a pro very popular, in fact, floor plan that we have done a few videos on, but this community is second to none. I can't wait to take you through it. Let's get into the walkthrough right now. So as I mentioned, my name is Keith Dublay, and if you've bought in Austin in a particular area, the chances are we've worked there as well. We have been doing this for a very long time and we love what we do. So this is a gorgeous house and it's one of the three models they had set up at the top of Treviso. Now Treviso is a super popular plan. It's actually on the way out as far as building. They're doing some more phases, but they're on the back half of the community. Opening up some new phases, the lot prices are gonna be quite a bit, anywhere from 275 to 450. And they're backing up to green belts and so forth. They've got a lot of options there still, but uh, the bulk of the build, there's a lot that's already happened in Treviso. So you're not gonna probably see a lot of lots with these kinds of views, but it's just so fun to go through these properties because they are stunning. Now, this, as I mentioned, is the Linmar 2. This property is a whopping 50, 100 square feet it is a five bed five and a half bath two-story home and this model is actually sold this model actually sold for two i think 2.5 it's been a long time sold for a long time ago and i think two years ago and now this house is actually being sold right around it's starting in the two million high ones to low two million and there are so many cool things you could do you can check out this kitchen this kitchen is so nice it's got this incredible butler's area inside the closet you've got this massive pantry there's also various options that you can get like the wine grotto um which is off the the dining or the the dining room there you can also get an extended um fourth bedroom or you can turn that into an independent suite or you can turn the uh you can do a fifth bedroom upstairs and there's just a ton of options you can do but this kitchen is very clean and very bright. When you walk in with the polished tile and all of the kind of middle of the road tones on the wood, not too dark, not too light, it really gives it that just gorgeous, very clean aesthetic. It's beautiful. And I really enjoyed this one. And by the way, if you like this plan, but maybe you don't love this house, this house is being sold on acreage lots by Drees in a community called Clearwater Ranch in Liberty Hill. And I will put the link right here. We did a walkthrough on that one. It's one of our top v v videos. People love this plan. It's one of Drees' most incredibly uh, well-selling homes. And by the way, Drees has actually got some larger plans coming as well. They've got the Linmar 4, which is starting, I think it's at 5,500 feet and it just has all the bells and whistles and it's incredible everybody loves these plans by Drees, the the linmar series and so they've really capitalized on it done a great job so you come in we saw that massive entryway the office to the right you go and see that beautiful living room it's got all the wonderful views into the yard sliding doors galore glass you've got picture windows you've got all kinds of uh natural light coming inside but this property is unique because of this incredible view you can see out of everywhere on the first floor you can have a view into the backyard so this is a formal excuse me yeah this is your formal living space that's downstairs tv room entertainment space however you want to call it and all of those downstairs living sp spaces uh the common areas your dining room and your living area have that beautiful rooms uh that flow right out into the, the courtyard area which man it just makes it so lovely and you can see that extended courtyard there's a catwalk above it i can't wait to show that to you so we're in the owner suite now with the tray ceiling of course all the trim work they do in these properties is you know aftermarket they pay a ton of money to have really really quality craftsmen come in and finish these houses out to really sell them make them pop Guys, look at that view. Are you kidding me right now? It's on top of that hill. This is almost the highest point in Treviso. And man, they nailed it. They put these three houses there. They're actually building another one right next to this. I'm excited to see what that one's gonna be. So as we walk through this owner suite, I'll take you through uh, kind of some of the dimensions of Treviso, just in case you are interested in getting um, you know, something going in this community. The Treviso community is several thousand homes. It's beautiful. And it's gonna be, HOA fees are about 900 a year biannually. So you're looking at about 450 every six months. Tax rates out there is about 2.58%. So if you have a million dollar home, 2.58% of that, obviously that's 
not cheap. So you're 20, 25 grand a year for property taxes. But the good thing is, is lots of people are coming here. It's very attractive. I was actually at this property. I met a new client um, when I was filming this property, believe it or not, coming in from California. They wanted me to help them um, because they just loved all the knowledge. And at the end of the day, it was really fun because I was able to walk them through them and show them like, if you're coming from California, a lot of people are incredibly happy. Real quick pause on that. Let me put a pin in that conversation. Did you see the control panel in the shower? There's double shower heads, double rain shower heads there. And how cool is that? There's no handles. Actually, those are, I'm sorry, the rain shower heads are handles. There's what I mean is there's no separate shower head for that. You can just pull them off and use them as the spray head as well. But uh, there's a control panel on the wall there. I think it's by Dupree, but they did a really cool control panel on the wall you can set your temperature with a digital display and how about this incredible closet so much space all these built-ins really really clean tons of opportunity for your shoes hat boxes and all the things so my wife loves this closet she loves our closet too we, got, we have a large closet we needed one but uh man just a great property all the bells and whistles in this one um now back kind of the what i was sharing a little bit before the the folks who came in i'm helping them now super excited to hear about how the tax they were saved so in tax in um california right now of course the property taxes uh you have uh property taxes you have your income tax and the sales tax and so on and so forth plus you know it's daily life is just a little bit more costly in california gas prices food groceries all those things entertainment generally a little bit higher many places they are many places some places they're not but all the folks who come here tend to see some happiness and some relief with the costs because it just really makes it a lot more affordable to live in texas so um yeah and i think also you'll find the property is a little cheaper here too now austin is getting more expensive for sure and in many areas it's actually comparable as california but if you're living in frisco or la or any one of the major in the bay area you know you're gonna see uh, Texas is going to be a great win for a lot of folks. So just kind of coming in. I love this office uh, right off the main entry area there. Sorry, I kind of squirreled, but I just wanted to kind of walk through that. It's a great com comparison. So I wanted to take you outside and just show you this incredible courtyard. So we have these sliding doors, the three panel sliding doors. So the first panel overlays the second and then the first and second overlay the third. So it opens up to a big wide opening. So on those cool days when friends are over, it's not quite too hot or too cold, you just flow in and out of that room. And man, it's just so beautiful. Come out into that courtyard and then you have that second covered area for that dining, uh, sit down barbecue dining area. Very, very nice. I think that's a six seater, but you could probably do eight there, no problem. Now these guys have um, a series of benches that are just out there by the pool, pool side um, recliners, just enjoying the pool side. That is a gorgeous pool and not a negative edge pool. A lot of the new models that we're seeing be put up, they put up those negative edge pools. If you do a negative edge pool, now the hot tub, by the way, is, but if you do a negative edge pool, it's probably going to add maybe 40% to the price of your pool because essentially you're doing another pool, right? All the water that falls off the edge is accumulated and pumped back into the pool. And that's like a little pool area. It's like a fountain, like a large one. So if you're going to do one, you want to maybe consider some of those options. But, uh, and if you need, by the way, that really makes me think if you have a vendor need, let us know. We've been doing this a long time. We've built a really quality list of supplied, uh, and vendors, uh, vendors and service providers that we trust that I use on my properties. And man, I would, I would be honored to share some of my folks with you if you have questions or needs. So just a, just a plug there. If you have any services, we'd love to serve you in that area. So we're going to head back in. That is a massive lot, by the way, just all the real estate at this part of Treviso to have that big of a lot. <laughs> it's something else. It's beautiful. So that would definitely be a, a significant lot premium. As I mentioned earlier, 275 to 400, 425 ish is about what we're looking at. Now, let me take you into this option here. Now, there's a cool little half bath. They did some marbling on the floor, but I want you to see what happens. Somebody spilled something on the floor. Do you see that by the commode there? That is a stain and that is a marble tile and it is stained and it is not coming up. Marble is extremely porous. I don't recommend it for floorings unless you're the Pope <laughs> and uh, or you can manage it really well, but just be cautious there. So this is the, um, they're calling it the uh, the additional living suite. It's, it's actually called um, 
the independent living suite. And this independent could be just a bedroom. Um, it's bedroom four. You can extend it out to be an extended bedroom four, or you can turn it into the independent living suite. And if you do, it does come with this full bath. And this full bath does serve the backyard too. So you can have that stand-up walk-in shower. You can go right out the back into the pool area or that back patio area if you like. And uh, it is great. Now they do have this layout in the Linmar 2 over in Clearwater Ranch, as I mentioned. So again, check out that video. I'll link it back up to the top here again. That is a fun video. We really enjoyed this plan. I love this plan. It's one of my favorite plans that Dries does. Dries is one of my favorite builders. They do a great job and we've always been super happy with them. And um, yeah, so we've got all these beautifully like well like featured out windows, the window lights that come through, uh, and all the architectural little finishes in here make it so nice. Here's a, uh, one of the bedrooms upstairs. And guys, we're gonna take you, by the way, that upstairs bedroom, there's a patio out there that door right there and there's access on both sides so there's this room that has a door out uh, of course this bedroom is ensuite has that full bath um, but you can go out that outside door right to that back patio with those views which I'll show you momentarily as we walk down the hall and then on the other side of the patio there's a door there as well there's an entertainment space over there game room and you can actually go out that into that same patio so very very cool now we're gonna go back down the hallway here I love how they have just this like open catwalk now a lot of a lot of uh, homes are doing this right now there are a few um, that uh, have this option but it's a very very fun kind of man it just like look at me I'm the king of the castle kind of a feel it's very grandiose very lovely and it's I love just being able to see down into the the main level and, and just it's so cool it's just very fun now this theater they did these fiber optic lights that had that star effect in that drop down um, um, they call that uh, it's called a fur down so they did that fur down and they did the fiber optics um, lights in there so it just twinkles which is so cool and then they have this uh, bar set up back here so you can have this like kitchenette type setup you can have all your wine bottles and your beer and your service stuff and just really kind of store things in there food items and plates and your popcorn boxes and all that jazz and just make this a killer theater space which is just man just beautiful so we have this um kind of multi-purpose bonus space here they have this set up for a work center um an entertainment area the linmar 2 over in clearwater ranch actually has a game room set up with like the basketball uh, game in there where you shoot hoops the gas ba basketball setup and so this is a, a very very versatile diverse bonus area and again here is that patio I was referring to in that bedroom across the walkway and these views guys wow just beautiful stop just jaw-dropping and just makes it so much nicer that it's down into the pool there so lovely got that uh Got that gorgeous view and the main road on the right there that comes up into Treviso. Just amazing. Um, so just so you know, a lot of amenities in Treviso. Um, definitely hit me up if you have any specific needs for neighborhoods that you're looking for. A lot of folks like golf courses. A lot of people are getting into pickleball. Guys, pickleball is out of control. It's like I saw this hilarious skit on pickleball the other day. Um, maybe i'll link that in the comments below but <laughs> it's uh it is an up and coming exploding sport there's a lot i don't think there's pickleball in treviso but there's a ton of amenities here and of course uh hike and bike all over the place just walking on the sidewalks gets you some really good exercise but it's a beautiful neighborhood so uh if you have any questions about amenities here definitely let me know and if there's some specific amenities that you want let me know um there's other neighborhoods that provide you a whole lot of stuff and we do community reviews too so i will do community reviews. for example we did a, a video series series on a neighborhood called Santa Rita Ranch and we did a full-on the best guide that you'll ever find on YouTube for that community I would put it up against any of the material I mean the production value is not quite as expensive as what the neighborhood uh, Santa Rita has done but as far as information man I don't think there's anybody who's gone even close to what we've been able to do on the video series for Santa Rita Ranch. So if you have questions about other neighborhoods um, um, in that video series specifically, we poured through all of the amenities, all of the builders, all the communities, all the everything, the schools, the taxes, everything. So uh, we do that on different videos. So if you have a video or a, a community that you're specifically would love to learn more about, 
let me know and we can kind of direct you to a, either a video we've done or will do or we'd be happy to call you because this is what we do. So this is the full bath off of the final guest upstairs. There's another final guest I was kind of talking too much, but you saw off that bonus space. There is one off that bonus space as well. And that is the upstairs. The upstairs is absolutely stunning. So then this is, as I mentioned, the Linmar 2. Um, there is uh, several other homes in Santa Rita Ranch that you want to, excuse me, I said Santa Rita Ranch. I meant Treviso um, that are similar, but the three model homes, if you like this one, you'll probably want to check out either the Catalina, which is right next to this one. It's by Taylor Morrison. You can check out the link right here, or you can check out the Kellen, which is also two houses down on the same road. And that one is by, um, Toll Brothers. And it's a gorgeous, gorgeous house. So feel free to let me know if this video was at all helpful for you, man, I'd just be blessed if you could just take two seconds and click that like button. It's lonely. It needs your encouragement. And maybe you could follow us and join our family here at YouTube. My community is growing. We're still a baby channel, but man, we would be honored. I would be honored if you would join me and link arms with me and just stay tuned. And the content that we're trying to provide, we're trying to make it better than anybody else with the drone footage that we do or all of the work that we put into neighborhood research and market research and all the videos we're trying to put together to give you all the information possible. And uh, we have folks calling us from California and Colorado, and it's just such a blessing you guys serving you and being a part of your life and helping you with the most expensive transaction out there. And uh, just knowing that I get to be that person that you're trusting to get that deal done for you, my goodness, it just blesses my soul and my wife thanks you. Uh, she's my team member and also my kids. They get to eat, which is also wonderful. So <laughs> if you could just uh, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button if this would be a value to you, if this has been a value to you, and I would love to have you be a part of our community. Thank you. Thank you so much. And again, thank you for taking time to do this walkthrough with us. If there's anything that you want to know or have questions, do me a favor, leave me a comment below and I will get to it right away. And in the meantime, be blessed and we will talk with you again soon.